course, in the next-gen car. You happy with your day? Yeah, I'm happy with my day. I mean, I just, uh, it takes me a while to get going. And, you know, with McDowell there at the beginning, like, he's just, he's ready and he's on kill. And I'm kind of working my way into it. And I just hate I lost the lead because it you know, just looked at the 24s back home for the rest of the day. But uh, it was fun to race. And I uh, appreciate the whole Mavis guys here and Toyota and Joe Gibbs Racing for giving me a good car and giving me, uh, the, you know, the tools I need to get better. As you look at next week, I know one of the goals this week was to keep Truex from locking in the regular season championship. You did that with the stage points you earned. Now you're 39 points from him. Doable? I mean, it's doable. We, you know, you got to have things go your way. But, um, yeah, uh, if we can talk NASCAR into those 25 points that took away <laughs> earlier in the season, uh, we'd really make it interesting. Denny Hamlin with a solid day here at Watkins Glen. Fourth today for A.J. Allmendinger. He was up front all afternoon long. But... Well, let's start with the physicality of this one. A lot of green flag running, and uh, it's not exactly cool out here today, so how tough was it out there? Yeah, I mean, it's tough. Like, uh, these, these last couple of weeks, uh, these cars are, are, I think, a lot more physically hard to drive than, than the old cup car, no yellows. And uh, with the tires not falling off, you feel like you're, even as the tires fall off, you still feel like you're running Q laps. So proud of everybody at College Racing. The Celsius Chevy was fast. I think if we could have got up there and cleared the, the Toyotas there, maybe had something for William. Just uh, it's so pass or so hard to pass in dirty air, but um, you know it's of course we wanted to win, but uh, super proud of of everybody at College Racing. Just uh, we're getting better. Uh, last week was disappointing, but um, proud of myself. I felt like I'd made no mistakes. That was all I had all day today, and um, you know something to build on. Does this type of effort and, and just execution all day long? Does it carry any weight next week when we go to Daytona where things are unpredictable, but ultimately you you still have to execute a, a perfect day? Yeah, I mean, I, I think, Dylan, it's just about, for our race team, of course, the, the playoffs would be great to get into, but, uh, you know, our, our ultimate goal is to keep building, getting better. And, uh, you know, last couple of weeks we've had some speed and, and struggles, and then we've, we've just struggled at speed at, at certain other places, but it's about building. Of course, we want to win. We want to make the playoffs. We're going to lay it all on the line next week doing it, but um, it's just about building momentum and, and just trying to get better. And I'm always trying to get better. 